Hi guys and welcome back to the lair. It's your girl Vade the Budget and Butterfly. If you're new here, hello and welcome. And for the family members returning, welcome back. So, hope you guys are all doing well in these times in the lives and happy turkey day. So, let's get into this. We're going to be cash stuffing in our sinking funds. So, let's count the cash, count the cash, count the cash, count the cash. 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. We're putting $50 amongst our sinking funds. Okay. All right. So let's pull out these binders. I have a high priority binder, binder for most important things and a medium. I don't have a low <clears throat> because everything is priority to me, baby. Okay. So we're going to go in our get it together 12 month budget book. And I'm just going to flip through over here to my little sheet that I have my little weekly cash stuff in. <clears throat> and this one has my sinking funds, savings challenges, cash envelopes, and anything else. I just put my bills here. So I have a cheat sheet and this lets me know where my money need to be going in these envelopes. All right, so let's move that to the side and let's get into this. So being that it's only $50, uh, this video is gonna be real short, okay? So, College grad is going to get a $10 bill. And all of these um, sinking challenges, I call them sinking challenges because these are challenges in my sinking funds. And um, they're all on my Etsy, okay? And they will come, <clears throat> excuse me, a page of two like this front and back. You can flip it and dip it and circle it and whirl it, whatever you want to do. So we put that 10 in. So that now brings us to 100, 200, 300, 400, 20, 30, 40, 50, 1. Four, <clears throat> oh, excuse me, guys. Four, 51. Let me recount this because you know it happens. 1, 2, 3, 4, 20, 30, 40, 51. Here we go. 451 it is. Next is going to be home. Home is going to get five. Let me let y'all check the challenge out. Home is going to get five. I have not been updating that, <clears throat> but I will. No worries. So let me get this five over here. So these gold bills represent what I have placed in my Capital One High Yield Savings 360 Performance Account. Okay. 100, 200, 220, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60. 260 is now in home and we're gonna need all them coins um emergency bills will be getting five put the five so emergency bills now has 120 140 150 155 160 165 66 67. 167 <clears throat> in emergency bills. Uh, debt snowball is gonna get 10 because we ain't really did nothing for her this month, but it's okay. Bringing it to 35. 35 better than no fives when it comes to adding extra payments to your debt. All right, <clears throat> rent increase is gonna get 10. All right, so rent increase now has, get it together, girl. Rent increase now has 150, 210, 20, 1, 2. 222, it's a good number, <clears throat> 222. Two, two. Okay, savings get anything? Yes, savings gonna get five dollars same is gonna get five see guys i'm not trying to you know i have a bunch of binders with <clears throat> different stuff i could be you know putting the money in but stuff within your budget like i only got fifty dollars i'm not trying to stress myself out about stuff in each and every one of my envelopes uh no all right so 150 70 85 86 186 in savings 
And this is just always additional money saved, guys, okay? And the last five is going to go to medical. All right. So everything was here in the high priority. See how I did that with them $50? I said, okay, I only got $50. I know I need this stuff, the important things. And that's what I did. Next go around, you know, with my chest savings challenges or whatever. If I got 2 $3 now, I'll take them and just, you know, throw them in the envelopes. All right, so we're going to add this last five to medical. Bringing medical to 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 110, 115, 120, 125, 26, 27, 28. 128 for medical. Woo, woo. All right, guys. And that was it for the cash stuffing of the sinking funds. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed creating it for you. If you haven't done so already, give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. How are you doing with your sinking funds? And like your girl always says, say $1, save $2, save $5, or save $10. And stuff within your budget. Bye.